Wee. Oh, we're done. Ugh. All right. Can I grab that gold feather, and then I'll be back up to five? That's pretty nice. You love Cheetos, huh? You love getting them all over your fingers? Uh, you like getting them on your fingers? Do you lick them off? Or like the, you know, the cheese dust off? Oh god, uh, that's unnecessary. Why did he dive bomb me that far? They're not gaming food. Well, depends on who you ask. Oh no, not again, not again, not again! Uh, oh, wow. Okay, he went through me that time. Give Pliz a voice in. Why did that not... Why is that not showing up, the actual emote? Alrighty then. So we're off again. I'm pretty sure I'm going the correct way here. Yeah, I'm doing this from memory. You know, what I could have done since the last time I was recording this... <gasps> What's that? This is a new recording session? <laughs> Asp. Um, what I could have done... Oh, my mouse cursor was over the thing. Uh, what I could have done was, you know, looked up like a, uh, I don't know, like a guide or something, and uh, like a, some sort of speed run, perhaps, and saw exactly where to go, but I didn't. I'm, uh, I'm staying true to this meme of, you know, let's, let's see how much Anthony actually remembers. Alrighty then, let's go ahead and get this. I, now, I can't remember if this is timed. I don't think it is. I can't remember if it's, like, timed up until the point where you, uh, actually get this. Which, once we go down this little urn, or I should say big urn, then we go down the giant Gruntilda statue and get that Jiggy from Bubble Goop Swamp. I remembered that. <laughs> uh, are we going on Red Feathers? I can't even remember. Hello? There we go. Good-ish. I'm the master. You know, that, oh my god, that actually reminds me. Uh, when I was little and growing up, the, you know, the bosses of each game, I would personally refer to them as a boss. You know, boss, mini boss, whatever. I don't remember where the first time I like heard that term was, but um, that's how I would refer it to. Uh, some of my friends actually referred to it as master instead. Uh, hmm, what am I forgetting here? Yeah, I need the, um, the booties. The big booties. Alright then. <laughs> what did I. <laughs> I said a bad word, so when was this? You know, I, I, I go through so many words so quickly that I didn't remember what I say. Um, did I. Oh, here we go. I was gonna say, did I get everything in this room? I'm doing lots of hugs in the chat, too. I say, ah, there it is. Uh, the butt word. Oh, man. The butt word. It's a banjo kazoo jamboree. I'll find it in post, yeah? Yeehaw! Alrighty then. So, oh, oh my! So you want to be a little bit careful with uh, standing in this quicksand-looking stuff. It won't instant kill you. Right! I need to actually open this level. Uh, <laughs> again, memory! Uh, this quicksand-looking stuff, because it won't instant kill you, but it does harm you, because... Sand eels exist in there. Good question. It's really hard to make these rhyme. Oh my goodness, I don't remember... 
where... Hmm. I don't remember where the Gobi's Valley one is. That was quicksand burning you. See, like, that's another thing that would make sense, because the level there is Gobi's Valley, and it's a very hot level. Oh, we, we don't have enough more notes here. Um, and it's a very hot level, so you would imagine that, like, you know, you could probably say that, hey, um, maybe the sand is just too hot to step on, but instead, oh, hey, we found the, the a cauldron at the very beginning. Uh, but instead, uh, sand eels live in there. Uh, I forget what that's for. Oh, I think I remember. Huh. Is it in here? I feel like it might be in here. If it's in here, then I'm doing these levels out of work. Yep, I'm doing them out of order. Okay, so I'm actually supposed to do Freeze Easy Peak first. Interesting. Oh, right! I already- I unlocked Freeze Easy Peak! That's right. Ha! Huh. I am doing them out of order. Silly me. Yeah, he has bare feet. Ha! Uh -huh. Funny! Until to put it through the heater. Also, yeah, you don't want to fall here. This actually is instant death to fall here. Uh, that's lava down there. There's actually a Cheeto page in that room, too. Uh, when you have to... Ooh, hello. You have to take the, uh... The, uh, 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 um... Beady, beady bop thing. Uh, the, uh, uh, Mumbo transformation from Mad Monster Mansion in the, uh... in that room, and it's a very very nerve-wracking little platform that winds around a lot, and, uh, yeah, one wrong move will send you into the lava. Alrighty then. So now that we're... Yeah. Now that we're in the place that we're supposed to be, here we are. This is probably, like, I feel like this this level is a lot of people's favorites. Like, who doesn't like Freeze Easy Pete? I'll fight him. Love how uh, all the children here have been left alone. Sad music playing in there. <laughs> Sliding off of his igloos. Ice physics. Well, that was more like that was more of a uh, steep, steep drop physics. What would you call it? Ice physics. There he is. There's uh, Boggy, the uh, the deadbeat dad. Ice levels suck. Oh no. This one, this one's nice though. Aside from the, th I think the thing that really irritates me about this level is the damn snowmen. Which yeah, we're about to see in about a second here. Because they are constantly throwing stuff at you. And uh, man, yeah, their uh, their aim is fairly good, even from far away. So we need a new. Uh, bottles. I almost called him Bubbles again. I noticed that I was doing that in the early earlier parts here. Uh, new Bottles move, which stacks with flying. The Twinklers! Alrighty. Oh! Oh, oh no. Please stop eating the little, the little twinkly lights. Oh. Oh! Ow. I don't like you. No! They're just trying to have a good time. Leave them alone. Oh, we got it. <sighs> Alrighty. 
The snowball sound like a rotten tomato effect. Oh well. Oh. <laughs> oh okay. Yeah. This this is yeah. This is the Canada level apparently, according to Boyson. Hello there, Mr. Jinjo. Yeah. Those guys were uh. Those guys were not cool. Oh, here's the new move. I forgot that it was here. Aerial action! The devastating beat bomb. <laughs> oh yeah, hey, we get to cruise missile here with uh with Kazooie. Alright, cool. Alright, so this is how you defeat the uh oops, the snowman. Ow. Okay, sniper mode in action. Good lord. Hello! Those those snowmen are definitely aimbotting. Oh, okay, seriously? I'm going for that guy first. Oh my god. Whoa! Oh, nope, I missed. Ah! ah. Yeah, you have to hit him on their axes. There we go. And uh, they drop some pretty good stuff, too. I can't remember if one of them has, like, an actual Jiggy. Oh, Well, that's bad. Yep, just uh, sliding to... to freedom there. My god. They're using the Halo aimbot. I'm definitely gonna need that. Haven't seen one of the actual bee-infested hives yet, which uh, is very much unlike the Minecraft beehives, which I've been enjoying. I don't like you. Santa's a fish. Oh my god! Seriously, these guys need to relax. Uh-oh. Uh nope. Okay. Ugh, there we go. This, um, this is really meant to teach you how the final boss battle goes. Uh, here. Not bad, two in a row there. Yeah, aiming it is a little finicky because not only do they move, but also, yeah, there's no, like, there's no, like, crosshair, there's no, like, aiming reticle or anything, you just, you're kind of, you just get used to it after a while. Essentially, you want to line up Kazooie's head with what you want to hit. There we go. I think that was the last guy. Oh, yep, it was. <laughs> Are they saying gumball? Uh, I assume you're talking about Banjo. I, I, I hear him saying, uh-oh. All right, that that particular jiggy there is very difficult to get because oh that's right um that spider webbing that I destroyed earlier with the uh, the behind egg shooting uh, out in that area before the Gobi's Valley painting that makes a um, a flying uh, a flying pad appear and you have to use the flight to get to that Jiggy, and it's timed. <sighs> or at least the flying pad is timed. Yeah, you have to run from, like, this main area where the entrance to Freeze Easy Peak is, run over to that area where the flying pad is, and make it there in time, and then fly. Once you got that, you, you pretty much got a bait, although you do have to do a little bit of uh, maneuvering still. But after that point, it should be free. Um... We're gonna go up the snowman super long scarf. Neat gum boo gum, indeed. Well, he's definitely not saying ooga booga. It's a speedrun killer. Oh, yeah, no, genuinely. I, I think I actually remember that from watching one of the, like, GDQ Banjo Kazooie speedruns. And, uh, yeah, that is super, super hard. There is a way to kind of, like, finagle it with, you know, speedrun hackery. But, oh man, it is it is so, so hard, even for long-time players of this game. 
you know, myself included, I, I tend to see myself as a professional banjo kazooie player. I play it literally every hour of every day. I don't know if you guys knew that about me or not. So it's gonna be a hashtag PWMW fact. Hey, we found our first present. We need three of those to uh, give to Deadbeat Boggies, Deadbeat Dad Boggies kids. Uh, there's something inside the snowman's pipe. I don't remember. Oh no! No! Oh my God! I'm naturally mind blown that I didn't die there. Yikers! Um. Well, I do have to collect some stuff around the feet. I guess we'll just do that now. Yeah, I'm a connoisseur. Oh, not a connoisseur of Banjo Kazooie. There's <laughs> extra doubt. Wow, Seb, of all the people that could have said that, why you? Come on. This is, uh. You're, you're not best friending correctly, I'm sorry. That's, uh. That's, a, that's gonna be a best friend penalty. Snowman taunt to the perfect moment. Good thing I left all this frickin' health here. Alright, oh, I see a bunch of music notes down there. Good, uh, future-proofing <coughs> on my part. You know, I don't, need, I don't mean to brag or anything, but, uh, yeah, that was, uh, definitely a genius move. I would say about 250, I feel. The actual Banjo and Kazoo. <laughs> All right, let's see if I can get in that corn cob pipe here. Be nice. I uh, oh, I literally could have just walked across here. Aren't right, I smart? Yay, yay! That's our first jiggy. A freeze easy peek. Despite the fact that I've been here for like over ten minutes. First jiggy yet? Oh, whoops! Oh god, I thought I was falling. <laughs> I was like, oh no, not again. Yeehaw! Now we need to get up to the very tippity top here, because we did see that I uh, I unlocked some magic. What? Whoops! Where am I going? When I killed the last snowman, it'll be right here. It's these uh, ice cube guys, which are very mean, and they split off into into twos. Oh god! I was like, wait a minute, please don't grab that jiggy just yet. Snowman, be smoking, bruh. Yeah. <laughs> don't. Don't smoke, kids. Smoking is bad, and it leads to a number of health issues. It's notably lung cancer, throat cancer, all sorts of different cancers that uh, most of which I probably don't even know. But hey, you know, don't do it. It's not worth it. What do, wait, what do, what you do to these ice cubes are humanitarian compared to what you do with Banjo Tui. Oh no. Yeah, that's, you know, that's a funny story. I, I still, I, I, actually, I have played Banjo Tui, but like, the, the first level, essentially. Not much more than that. Oh, whoops, I made an oopsie. Hang on. We gotta, we gotta deviate here. Let me just uh, pull up my deviant art. Okay, oh, oh god, there we go, and we want to jump on here. Whee! Uh. Ha! Yep, that happened. Alrighty. So, uh, the big sled race. That's another thing in this level. Yay, yay! Uh-huh. Unless you're smoking food. Hmm. Interesting. I don't... I don't really remember ever smoking my food, but uh, I do like eating it. If that counts. Alright, let's hop on over to... Uh, oh, my, I guess I might as well collect this up here first. Oh, um... Where is that second... Oh. I'm so glad that they whistle. I probably would never have noticed that guy. Um... Where is that second honeycomb piece? I... Oh, I know where it is! <laughs> yes, memory.
Thank you.